I need to cut my routine down because my routine is way too long. Yeah, it shouldn't take all day. Okay, it'd be taking all, all day. day. Right. <laughs> so I need to dedicate at least three hours. <laughs> <laughs> I get into the shower. Sometimes I'll prep before. Okay. So I'll do a deep conditioning mask, or sometimes I do it the night before and I sleep over, sleep with it That's overnight, over right? Because I want it nice and silky. Silky, <laughs> right. And then I'll wash it out, shampoo, with probably like a gentle clarifying shampoo. And then I'll do like a deep conditioner. And after that, I get out, what is that towel called again? Oh, the microfiber The towel. microfiber yeah. towel, there we go. Yeah, I will need one of those. <laughs> yeah, you definitely need that. Yes. And if not, you can use a t-shirt. Mm -hmm. I grab one of those, I have that in my hair, and I also bring my mister out. Mm -hmm. You always need a mister because our hair tends to dry up in the towel, right? Yeah, yeah, good tip. Right, so I, I wanna make sure my hair is soaking wet, spray it down, and I work in sections. And I put the primer on, which is like a cream, okay. right? Like a leave-in conditioner. And after that, I move on into like a gel base, something that can create like the cast. Little mm -hmm. hold. Yes, mm -hmm. a nice little hold, because you know, I like it to last for like at least a week. If I need to go somewhere, I'll diffuse it. Other times I try to let it air dry. It just right. depends. Okay, I love it. Very, very easy and simple. My hair care routine, it actually is like an hour. I don't take all day. So like I can do this routine in like an hour. Yeah, last night, yeah. Anyway, but tell me. I need okay, so I start when I start out my hair. I don't detangle outside the shower. I do it in the shower for like five minutes. I just like quickly, like you know. And then I shampoo and I shampoo twice actually. Like scalp hair, rinse it out. Scalp hair, rinse it out. And then I go in with either a deep conditioner or conditioner. And then I usually just do a wash and go. And that's like, yeah. <laughs> My curly hair routine actually depends on like if I'm going for an undefined look or if I'm going for like a defined curl look. Mm -hmm. I like to do the undefined. I feel like it's a lot easier. We don't like wasting time on our hair. It looks hair. really good. Thank you. <laughs> so on a wash day, which takes forever, I like to detox my scalp. So either oh. I like to use a scrub. I have seborrheic dermatitis, so my scalp mm. does like get really flaky. So I like to, you know, tackle that. Then I use my shampoo, conditioner. If I'm feeling fancy, I might use my deep conditioner in my hair, but that just makes the whole like process a lot longer. So it just depends how I feel. And then I like to put more water in my hair, like once I'm out the shower, cause sometimes my hair dries fast. It just kind of depends. My hair does not like taking moisture without like having water already in the hair. The hair has to be wet. Yeah. I cannot moisturize my hair dry. So I'll start off with like a lighter product and then I like to go in with like a double butter cream. So something thicker to kind of like lock it in, lay my edges and then I'm done. I'll brush it out, like the curls out. So if I wanted to find, like I'll probably go in and finger coil it. And if I do finger coil it, I'll add like a, like a curl custard just to help it with more definition. But if I want it undefined, I'm leaving that out and I'm just literally brushing my hair out and waiting for it to, you know, get bigger. So you do basically like a wash and go? Yeah, kind of. for the most part, but I'm not going. I'm not <laughs> going with my hair wet. That's not happening. Oh, okay. Because the shrinkage yeah. is going to be like to my, <laughs> to my ear. I need to cut my routine down because my routine is way too long. Yeah, it shouldn't take all day. Okay, it'd be taking yeah, all, all day. day. Right. Yeah, so first I'll like put some kind of mask on mm -hmm. and that'll take a while. I'll part it into four sections and I'll work in those four sections the whole time. Yeah. So I'll like put whatever oil or some treatment on it and I'll leave that in for some hours and usually I'll watch anime or I'll take a nap. Hours is crazy. <laughs> hours is crazy. Hours is, well, I just be chilling. <laughs> it's usually the nap part. And then I'll finally like, okay, it's time to get in the shower. So I gotta okay. rinse that out. Right. Then I gotta wash it. I'll do a clarifying shampoo, mm -hmm. then another shampoo, and then I'll condition it like two or three times then I'll get out, and I'm detangling it in, in sections right, in right, the shower. Right. Yeah. Then I'll get out the shower and moisturize. I do this, the LLC thing, so the liquid oil <laughs> cream. Then I'll braid it, 
let that dry. Mm -hmm. Usually take another nap. Is it a braid out? Yeah, no, because I'm oh. not even wearing a braid out, so I don't know why I'm braiding it. Okay. But okay. I just don't want to have to comb through it again, right. so I'll braid it. Okay. Then. <laughs> take like that seven then. I'm so tired. <laughs> then I take that out uh -huh. and then I do whatever style I'm doing. Oh, okay. So this is two days. Yeah. Two to three days. Yeah, this was two hours. See, I know. Yeah. I'm upset. It's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you on my. Yeah, please. Yeah. Just send me the product. Okay. Sis, because I got this you. is I'm upset. I got it's a lot you. of work. Okay. No. So <laughs> and I'm not even showing my hair. Like I'm not gonna see it. It's a lot. So for me, I, I typically wash, I do deep condition every week, <laughs> oh, just because my hair is, <laughs> it's, it just gets so dry, so yeah. I'll usually like work at the same time, and then I will always do a braid out, almost always. Oh, you have time. Yeah. <laughs> I have to make time <laughs> if I want it to look right, yeah. So like what products are you using? So I usually use um, a leave-in conditioner and I try to avoid butters unless I'm going somewhere that's really cold. I travel a lot, so it just depends on the climate, but like on a regular day, I'll use a leave-in conditioner, follow it up with an oil, and then just braid it down. And then if it's still wet the next day, I usually use a diffuser. Oh, so you usually do your wash days like in the evening? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, no, I'm morning girly, get it really? out the way. Yeah, in the night, I don't like sleeping with my hair wet. Oh, yeah. So it's like, okay, I just wake up and like get it out the way, run my errands while it's drying, and then, yeah, I'm done. I prefer an evening routine just because I feel like it's actually a way to wind down, believe it or not. It's kind of like a part of my self-care ritual. I actually will do castor oil the night before mm. to moisturize my scalp because my That's scalp good. tends to be super dry. Oh, so I'll yep. sleep in that with like a silk bonnet and I usually wash like every eight to 10 days give and take. And then I go in with a clarifying shampoo. Mm. I do it twice. You condition in the shower, same thing, start at the ends, work through sections. Mm. I get out mm -hmm. and immediately follow with leave-in spray, which I love because it's not too thick. It's very lightweight. So you can build on top of that with products. Right. Then I go in with curl milk, which is like my mm. big favorite like that's what I use every day. I need day. to try that I've heard you about it. You do need to try that that's I mean your curls are amazing but it's to yeah. me it's my go-to. Okay. So I throw that in my hair I comb it through and I actually don't diffuse unless I'm going for a very particular look because when I right. diffuse I look like Shirley Temple like my curls really? were shrink up to like yeah, right here. No, 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 I get it. So I just air dry wash and go mm -hmm. very simple and then I'll maintain throughout the week. Okay. I'm Persia. And I'm Miriam. I'm Fola. And I'm Roxy. I'm Christine. I'm Francesca. And, and this, this is our Curl Fashion. Subscribe and smash. That's what the Gen Z says, right? <laughs> smash. Subscribe right now. Don't forget. Did you get it? Yeah. You elegant? Stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what do I do? <laughs> So, okay, okay. <laughs> hey you guys, what's up? I'm Ava Pearl, founder of Curly Culture, a community for people with all types of curly hair, from a 2A to a 4C. Let us know what you guys wanna see in the comments below, and we'll see you guys on our next episode. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel.